Hello everyone and welcome to West Coast Thrift Journey. So on today's adventure, we are gonna pop into a couple of the Goodwills and see what we can find. So in this location, as soon as I get through the door, I find this huge, beautiful basket. As you can see, they go for quite a bit of money on the internet. I looked up some baskets to see how much this one would actually be worth around and I am so excited to pick this one up and I will be selling it for quite a bit of money and I'm only paying $14.99. So let's see what else we can find. If this is the first time that you are stopping in to watch any of my videos, welcome to West Coast Thrift Journey. If you love boho and you love eclectic and you love bargains, this is definitely the place for you to be. So up next, I found this really awesome boomerang and I'm gonna put this in my cart and let's see what else I can find. For just $2.99, I'm gonna pick up this really cute jewelry box and I'm gonna use it for resale. Mel also has come across some hairspray and she's gonna throw that in the cart and we're gonna be purchasing this as well. The next item that I found is this cute little owl placard. I think you just put your little um, recipe clip to it. Up next, I also found up here on the top shelf this beautiful pillar that I will be purchasing for $7.99. As I move along, as you can see, I am adding everything to my cart and it will be part of my haul. So up next, I found this really cute piece. It is just faux, but it's so adorable. And it's priced at $2.99, but yellow tags are half price. The next item that I came across is this sweet little Chinese teapot. I looked up the comps on this and as you can see, I'm gonna get a really great deal and be able to resell it for quite a bit. So also I came across these really beautiful fans and this huge fork. So I'm gonna throw these all in my cart and I will reveal these fans in just a little while because Mel found me some really cute candles to put in a piece that I have found up here on the top shelf and I will show you that right now but not before I find this cute little planter for $2.99. It is Mexican pottery that is painted with these beautiful roses. So I'm adding that to my cart and then I come across these beautiful, really awesome, I just could not even believe it, but these are bookends with candle holders on the very end of them. And I've never seen that before. I even tried looking them up but I am also gonna pick up this really cute purse. I think it's really fun and it'll be great for summer. Wow, what a great deal at $4.99. So the next item that I came across was this really cute trinket box and I'm really disappointed because the whole front of it is damaged. So I'm leaving this behind as someone else's treasure. For $3.99, I found this beautiful knitwear bag and I think it's so awesome. I am really excited to pick up this piece and add it to my collection, as well as this beautiful skirt that Mel found me for $9.99. I can't wait to wash this up and wear it soon. As I'm checking on the next aisle, I find something down here on the bottom shelf. So let's pull this out and see what it is. It's $3.99. Yes, I need to flip it over and hold on to the handle. I believe you put a plant down in it and hang it on your wall. I've never seen a piece like this before. So I'm gonna go ahead and add this to my cart. So up next, I found this really beautiful blown glass bowl for $12.99. And as you can see, the comps on that are really high. I did not pick that piece up. I also came across this piece, and if you guys know what it is, make sure and leave me a comment below. Okay, time for the reveal on these beautiful fans. Mel is gonna open up the first one, and it has beautiful flowers and butterflies on it. It's so gorgeous. 
These fans are priced at $4.99 a piece. As you can see on the next one, it is a beautiful village. Just look at how it just looks so absolutely gorgeous. I'm so excited to pick these up. So when you look up the comps on fans, they are extremely high. I'm not saying that mine are worth this much, but it's always definitely worth checking them out. I also came across this beautiful scroll for $3.99. I think it's so absolutely gorgeous. These do go for about twenty to thousands of dollars online. You just really have to look them up and see which one you have. So we are going to go ahead and check out and we're going to head to the next store and I will meet you guys there. I'm really excited for you guys to see what I find. The next location that I'm heading to is Northwest Cornell Road in Hillsboro. Mel is going to go ahead and head over to Gymnastics with Piper and I'm going to head into the store and see what I can find. I only have 45 minutes to shop this store and I'm really anxious to see what they have on their shelves so let's get back there and check it out. If you guys are loving this video so far, be sure to give me a big thumbs up, share to your friends, and make sure and subscribe. So up next, we are just going to head right into all of these shelves and see what we can find. I'm really excited to see what this store has. I'm always sure to fill up my cart, and you guys know how it is, so let's get busy. One of the first items that I came across for $10 is this really beautiful teapot. I was just amazed that it was on the shelf at the end of the day. And then I also came across these little Mexican pieces of pottery. They're just some little bowls for $4.99. So I'm going to add those to my cart. And then for $10, I'm also going to be picking up this fabulous teapot. I am so amazed that I found all of these. And then I'm also going to pick up this next piece. So let's check them out. They are really cute. I've never seen these before, but I am really excited to find these and they are $9.99. So I'm going to have to look up the comps on these. I just haven't had the time. So I'm really excited to find all these pieces, but then I turned around and I found the most awesome pieces that I think I have found all day. These are actually online and I will show you guys what they are worth. I am so excited to show you. I, I am just amazed at some of the things that I actually found today. So for over $700, these bookends are worth. But let's get back into the store and see what else I can find. I think every day I come across items that don't have a price tag, so I'm going to take this up front and ask for a price when I'm checking out. But then I came across this cute little gourd that actually has been hand painted, and I am going to add this to my cart. It's actually for napkins. I've never seen one like that before. And then also I'm going to pick up this really beautiful piece of pottery. I think it's such a great deal, and I just love all of the glaze that is just dripping down the sides of it leave me a comment below and let me know what you guys think i also would like to know if you guys would have picked this piece up for three dollars and 99 cents i think it's so adorable but it has an inkwell in it and then you just put your pen in it and then uh, write and i think that that is just so cute i'm sure i will resell that on my facebook marketplace and then I thought picking these pieces up would be so cool just to kind of add to someone's collection or maybe for someone's guest room. If you just put a cork in the top of this piece and use the other one for someone to um, just use for water after brushing their teeth and maybe in this uh, piece with the cork, you just uh, put some mouthwash in, that would just be so amazing to give to somebody. So up next, I came across this candle holder and I thought it was a little older, but I'm gonna go ahead and set this back on the shelf and leave 
save it for someone else's treasure. And then I came across this really cute basket, but yikes, I think this basket is a little overpriced, so I'm gonna leave this behind as someone else's treasure. Wow, look at how cute this basket is. It's so amazing. It's Noah's Ark. As I turn it around, I see all the animals, but I do see some animals that are missing, so I'm gonna leave this one behind as well. Right at the end of this aisle, I found this cute little shoe from Holland, and I know you guys always see me pick this one up, and here's an idea of what you guys could do with these. I love to plant in these, and then I came across this really cute cup from Puerto Rico, so I'm going to add this to my cart as well for resale. I love to find wood spoons and I came across this measuring cup, but it's just a little too pricey for me, so I'm gonna leave this behind. Thank heavens I have finally made it to the art. I always enjoy looking at the art and the first piece that I came across I am so excited for, so let's check it out. At $4.99, I'm gonna add this to my cart and I just might resell it, but I also might add it to my gallery wall. The next picture that I came across for only $3 is this really beautiful piece. I believe this is a, an original portrait and it was taken in Rome. So I'm gonna go ahead and add this to my cart. The next item that I found is this really beautiful portrait of Mother Mary and baby Jesus. For $4.99, I'm adding this to my cart and I will actually show you guys what it looks like on my gallery wall at home. It's simply gorgeous. I'm so excited to add this to my gallery wall collection. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and check out this end cap. I found this huge gourd bowl and I am gonna pick this up for $3.99. They do go for about 20 to 30, sometimes 40, $50 online. And I think that I will be able to get at least 20 for that. So up next, I found this really beautiful kimono. I'm really excited to pick this piece up and then I'm gonna go ahead and check out. All right, guys, I'm gonna check out, and I just wanna say thank you so much for coming along on this journey today to both of these really great Goodwills. I have filled my cart in both of them, and I'm really excited to show you guys everything along the way in my haul. Until the next time, you guys have a great evening, and be sure to like, subscribe, and share to your friends. And here is some beautiful video of my night at downtown Portland for the 4th of July.